Hey, greetings everybody. We're oh, just making sure my hair's looking good. How does it get any better than that? Well, today, well, actually last night was uh, really good fun. I had uh, I had taken actually one of my tools and I talked about in I think day five um, where you keep your wallet nice and tidy. And I had a, actually had a look at my wallet last night and it was like, oh my God, um, all the notes in there are starting to get a little bit creased and folded up and I really haven't um, taken any care with my wallet for quite a few days. Hi Louisa. And um, one of the things with that was, oh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to clean it out. So I took all my money out of there and I started to count it, which was really good fun. I had twice as much money in my wallet than I actually thought that I had, which actually when I started to acknowledge how much money that I had that I didn't know that I had, it was like, wow, that is part of the creation of the $10,000 is the acknowledgement of what you already have. So how many of you have been unacknowledging what you don't have or acknowledging what you no, unacknowledging what you don't have and creating more of the I don't have reality and universe and everything that is, will you now destroy and uncreate it all? Good and bad, right, wrong, pop, pop, corn, I, short boy, he goes, hi Cheryl, how you doing? Woohoo! Um, so in, in taking out my um, money and playing with it, I found that there were a lot of bills in there, uh, smaller bills, and I like to have big bills in my wallet, and the small bills are for my pocket, and uh, they're just for fun, just to spend any way I like. But when I was actually looking at them, there were a couple of there were a couple of bills that I had in here. And here's ten ten rand from South Africa. There we go. I'm sure you can all see who is on that um, bill there. M Nelson Mandela. Hey, it's my favourite person who just joined us. How does it get any better than that? Um, now then, I started to have a look at some other bills, and here's a five pound note. Winston Churchill. Okay, cool. Awesome. How does it get any better than that? Then I had a look, look at another bill. And here uh, is a Japanese bill. And this one here, I can't remember his name um, because it's in Japanese. I can't read it. But he is a famous Japanese poet. Yeah. So then I started to have a look at all these other bills. Here we have um, an American 50 with uh, w William Gr is it William Grant? I uh, can't remember who is any. I uh, can't remember who it is because he's uh, he's an American. It's Grant. I think he was a um, famous general. Now, what if your money? What if you actually had your picture on your money? It's it's like I was thinking about that. The energy that these people be, especially people like M Nelson Mandela. And Winston Churchill, who really changed realities. What if we were willing to be that energy of the people that are on the actual bill? No, and I'm not actually talking about duplicating their energy, but willing to be what they will... <laughs> How can I say this without you guys thinking that you've got to go and be William Chur uh, Winston Churchill? What were they willing to be that you're not willing to be? That if you were willing to be it, would allow you to have more money than God. And good morning from, is it Poulet? Uh, good morning. That would allow you to have more money than God. And everything that doesn't allow that, can we now destroy and uncreate it all? Good and bad, right, wrong, pop, pop, or and I, and short boys, meals. So... What are you unwilling to be with money that if you were willing to be it would allow you to have more money than God? And good and bad, right, run, pop, pop, corn, and I, short boys and meals. Just, uh, just before this um, Facebook Live, um, I had a look. Hi, Charlie, how you doing? Um, I had a look at uh, an, uh, an, a friend's Facebook page, Matt Boschler, and what he was asking on there was about limitations. And then I put on my Facebook page, oh my God, uh, what if 
uh, limitation was actually a lie, or the idea of limitations was actually a lie told to us. Are we truly limited beings, or can we be any energy that we choose to be? So, for you to have ten thousand dollars, what energy do you could you be that you're not being? That if you allowed yourself to be that, would create ten thousand dollars with total ease. And everything that doesn't allow that, can we now destroy and uncreate it all? Good and bad, right, wrong, pop, pop, corn, eyes, short boys, and meons. <laughs> I love Charlie, he's always giving me love hearts. How does it get any better than that? Um, this Facebook Live is very different to all the others. Can you tell that I'm not my hugely uh, outrageous, um, enthusiastic self today? Um, and that's not a rightness or a wrongness. And this is one of the things that I've been looking at lately is how much, is when, uh, when I am... Maybe not, you know, like, wow, super happy. I go into judging myself for not being that energy. How many, guy, how many of you guys do that? That when things are not rolling the way, hi, Owie. Um, I'm in Tokyo, hi, Iga. Um, how many of you go into that some sort of judgment of, of self um, that you're not, you're not being as happy as you were yesterday? when actually it's just a change of energy. So everywhere where you've judged yourself as not being the happiness, not being a particular energy that you have made highly significant, would you now be willing to destroy and uncreate all of that? Good and bad, right, wrong, pop, pop, corn, eyes, short boys and beyonds. And what else is possible? So, I'm going to the COP class today, uh, Choice of Possibilities with Gary Douglas. Um, it's our last day today, so who knows what will show up. Um, and tomorrow is going to be our last video. Uh, how many of you have created um, something different with these videos? Whether you may manage to get the 10,000 or not is totally irrelevant to a certain degree because it's what you be. What if what you be is so much more vital for you, for the planet, for consciousness? I'm also just going to put a little ad in here. I'm going to be starting to do a, a, a little video series similar to this Facebook Live about conscious creation. Um, it was a it was a conversation that Gary and I had. Uh, Gary and I, no, Dane and I had at the COP. And um, when I started talking about that, my molecules started to get very, very excited. And I'd like to share that with you. Yeah, exactly, Jennifer. Jennifer you ha uh, By doing these tools, it's often that you're creating for a future. So if you haven't created the money right now don't go into the wrongness it's just not shown up yet keep going keep going never give up never give in uh, never quit and what else is possible i'm gonna go now ciao thanks for listening you're awesome <laughs>